confidence is probably the most underrated yet overrated subject of all time. Maybe not all time. The results are still coming in about that. But confidence is overrated in the fact that oftentimes we're told that we should be more confident. We're given this advice. And while technically true, it is not exactly helpful advice because it's just so broad and so general and it doesn't really explain anything. But on the flip side, confidence is very underrated because a lot of people don't really understand the power of true self-confidence. So in this video, I'm gonna be defining confidence. I'm going to be articulating, you like that word? Articulating the benefits of being confident and also I'll be giving you guys practical steps on how to build self-confidence. So, first of all, confidence is your self-belief. Someone who is truly confident literally, literally has, like, can literally go get whatever they want, okay? Confidence is your self-belief. Confidence is your self-worth, your self-esteem. It is an internal thing that traces of are externalized. Now, confidence can be faked. You can emulate the external effects of confidence pretty easily, but having true confidence is completely different. So, the benefits of confidence are obviously someone who is very confident and has high self-belief can pretty much go get what they want. And it's not that they think they can get what they want, it's that they know they can get what they want if they're willing to put in the time and the effort to go get that thing, right? It's a completely different feeling when you know you can go achieve something and get something. It's a completely different feeling when you are truly confident in yourself and you can just take charge of social situations. It's a completely different feeling when you are so confident that you can just command respect because people can sense that energy off of you. There are numerous benefits of being confident. I can't list them all because I'll probably forget some, but just know that having self-confidence, having high confidence, translates to success in pretty much every single area of life because it's such a it's an internal thing that you'll always have with you and it translates to all areas of life it translates to success in finance success in relationships success in literally everything so with that out of the way let's get into the practical steps to actually build confidence now this is from my own experience. This is I'm not gonna be citing somebody's uh, research paper. Shout out to that guy if he wrote one. This is from my personal experience. Now confidence is going to be, now confidence is a skill, it's an art form. So let's say right here is your confidence. It could be going this way or this way. It's not a static feeling. Once you have confidence, you can lose it, but you can also gain it. So it's constantly moving. And in general, the way to build confidence is by taking productive action towards a goal. So for example, if your goal is to get absolutely shredded, like you're gonna be you know, working out every day, you're gonna be eating properly, and by Doing these things and taking action towards your goal, you will actually be building confidence. Now, fitness is just an example. It's probably the easiest example I can give, but really any goal, it doesn't have to be fitness. Like for me, my goal is to make videos. So simply by making this video, I am gaining confidence. But the flip side is also true 
if you do things that do not align with your goal, like for example, if you're trying to lose weight and you go out and eat a cake and a pizza, you know, that's moving away from your goal, so your confidence will actually start going down. So it's kind of a balancing act. I'm not going to I'm not saying like you can't go eat pizza. I'm just saying that if what if your actions do not align with your end goal, you're going to lose confidence. That is the simplest way to say it. So anyways, I hope this video was able, I hope I was able to articulate to you guys the importance of confidence, how to build it, all that stuff.